What's good, y'all? It's your boy, Nikki the Jeweler with Masari Creations, and I'm gonna show y'all how to use this generic diamond tester. This is the one that everybody buys on eBay, Amazon, what have you. You know, this is the one that everybody has. Uh, I haven't seen too many detailed videos, so I'm gonna drop a better one for you guys with a little more uh, common mistakes and stuff like that. So uh, first of all, you wanna turn it on. And you gotta wait till the lamp on ready okay light turns on. So until this turns on, you know, you, you gotta wait. So let's just skip back to here. So um, I have one, uh, I have, so, so you wanna adjust this right here. You see, you have to adjust this to the number according to the stone you're testing. So right here we have some 1.5 millimeter stones which are less than 0 0.05 carat. So this is the row that we're gonna look at. If you had a bigger stone, you'd go, you know, 0.6 and up, 0 0.06 to half a carat, you know. So we're here at the small size, y'all see it? So we're gonna go on this row. Temperatures between 10 to 30 degrees Celsius, always here in Cali. So, so we're gonna go on six, that's the one we're supposed to use. It's ready for us, so let's go to six, right here, you know, up, down, whatever, and let's go. So when you test a diamond, you have to make sure your hand is touching this in some way. If it's not, it's not gonna work correctly, and you're gonna think your diamond tester is not working, that's not what it is, everybody forgets this part. So remember to leave your hand on the back of it, this part may move by itself, so always keep an eye on it. It, it just it just happens. So when you hit metal, you're gonna get like a really loud constant, like like just some crazy beep, like just like that. That's metal. Now if you hit CZs, let's see, I'll adjust it back. If you hit some CZs, it's gonna do the same thing as glass. Nothing. And uh, if you hit diamonds, well, we gotta, I gotta show you what it does. So let's see if, I think these ones are real diamonds. That's, and then don't worry if it, if it makes the metal noise, it's cause it slips a lot on these smaller stones. Diamond. Diamond. Okay, you get the point. These are diamonds, these are real diamonds. That's how you know. Let's see, this should do the same if they're real. If they're not, then we should get nothing. No beep, just the metal noise. So it's just metal right there. Let's see. Nothing. So these are CZs, you know? That's how you tell. Now, one thing is, the diamond tester cannot tell you what is lab made and what's not. So you gotta test them different ways for that. This just tells you if it's real, it detects carbon, which is what diamonds are made out of. Hand on the back, right? And these stones are actually bigger. So we have to adjust this one. We have to adjust it to 0 0.06 to a half carat. Same temperature, that's four. Don't forget to adjust it. Don't forget to touch the back. Real diamond. Metal.